The bacteria that cause meningitis, we all carry, or many of us carry with us at all times, and it's if they're in our mouth or in our nose or in our sinuses, they may not cause any problems at all. But um, if we're unlucky enough for them to get into the brain or around the lining of the brain, that's where we get symptoms. That's, that's when we develop the disease. The viruses that cause viral meningitis are also fairly ubiquitous. Enteroviruses are the most common cause, and they're also causes of uh, diarrheal illness, gastroenteritis, uh, sometimes um, colds, uh, and they don't cause much problem unless they get into the, around the lining of the brain.